Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy C. Lee with another edition of Charles Talks. Here we have a very special guest, Miss Annie. She's of the Spanish department here at Bishop Knoll. Yes, I said it, here at Bishop Knoll. She is one of the best Spanish, Spanish teachers here and we are going to learn within this interview her origin, how she first started to speak Spanish and where she's actually from. So sit back, relax, enjoy the interview Let's find out more about this amazing person, Miss Anna. Hi guys, I'm Celie and I'm here with the Spanish teacher here at Bishop No, Miss Anna Hicks. So let's get straight to the question. So where are you originally from, Miss Hicks? Well, I was born here in East Chicago, raised here, but um, half of the time I was living in Mexico with my parents. So it's pretty much between Mexico and here. Okay, okay. Now we know that in most Latino homes that you could be of the heritage but not really speak the language in your home. So when did you first start to speak Spanish? At a very young age. The rule at my house was that we had to speak Spanish. And because my mother really didn't speak in English, we had to translate for her. And we had to just kind of be the translators and speak fluently. And as we were older, it just kind of helped when we went to Mexico, so. Do you think it's easier to speak Spanish or English? I think it's easier to learn it at a younger age, but as you get a little bit older, it becomes a little more intimidating because, as we all know, teenagers don't want to practice, they feel embarrassed. But um, the phonics in English are a little bit difficult because there's like two sounds, and in Spanish it's just one, so I would say it's a little easier. Okay, so how do you like teaching students here at Bishop know about the culture and the language? I love teaching here. Um, I love the students. I, I cherish every one of them, even my little troublemakers. But um, I, I like the fact that everybody wants to learn about everybody else's culture. And we incorporate not just like Latin America from Mexico, but other parts of Latin America and Spain. Okay. Well, guys, there you have it. There is the great Spanish teacher, Miss Anna Hicks, and we are out.